Okay, let's understand the calculation of area of a rhombus. Do you remember what a rhombus is? Or not? A rhombus is basically a parallelogram in which all four sides are of equal length. Okay? So the area of a rhombus is basically equal to half into D1 into D2, where D1 and D2 are two diagonals. Let's see how you calculate this. Let's say you have a rhombus A, B, C, D. Okay? Now, basically, let's say the center point is O. In a rhombus, the perpendicular bisect each other. Which means that OA is equal to OC and OB is equal to OD. Let me put here through this. Okay. Now, basically, again, if you see, what is the area of triangle? There are two of them. So you have green triangle and you have yellow triangle the area of this ABCD is equal to the area of the yellow triangle plus the area of the green triangle or triangle ABD plus triangle BDC. Now what is the area of triangle ABD? It is going to be half into base. What is the base of triangle ABD? It's BD into height. And what is the height? Height is equal to OA plus half into what is the base of triangle BDC the one in the green mark again it is BD into height and height is what height is OC now again if you see half BD is here half BD is here so you can write this as half BD into OA plus OC picking up OA from here and OC from here right but what do we notice here? OA plus OC. OA plus OC is nothing but AC. Right? So you can also write this as half BD into AC. And what is BD? BD is nothing but your first diagonal. AC is your second diagonal. And hence the derivation of this formula comes. So area of a rhombus is basically equal to half into the product of its, the length of its diagonals. 